Okay, this is uh, this tutorial that I've been trying to show you for a while now. I've been running into a lot of Linux errors. I'm sure you guys, Linux is, uh, if you don't use Linux every day as your home computer, you know, you, uh, you're going to always, you're going to have errors and hassles and problems and things you're not used to. So anyway, uh, as you can see, um, this window I've got the Firefox browser and I've gone to the localhost web server and I've also gone to test.html and you can see that it says this is a test which I created so that's working. Alright, let me show you how I did that. Okay, um, running updates. Okay. Alright, here is, uh, well, the first thing I needed to do to get this working was I had to go to applications system tools terminal and what I did was is I did a su space dash l and I sued the root put in my root password so now I have root access and then from there I fired up Nautilus Okay. Nautilus opens up and notice what it says up here at the top it says root that's not my normal user so now I know that I've opened up this file browser as root and then I can browse back to the root folder right here uh, to get this uh, cool browser setup for going through Nautilus and browsing through your directories using the GUI tool I had to set edit preferences in the browser window and I went to behavior and I clicked on always open in browser windows and this will help you so that you can have these breadcrumbs here so you can go back and forward uh, navigate you know, also the browser tools up here back up you know and also see the um, sub menu on the left and when I did that what I did was is I went all the way down to the var directory and then I went to the www directory and then there's the HTML directory and in there I was able to create a file called test.html what I really need to do though is create a file called index.html so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna right click create document empty file okay and I'm gonna call it index.html okay and there it is and I needed to have root privileges so I could create a file in this folder because this was a uh, uh, root privileges only folder this is not Dan's folder so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna um, open it with a text editor here and there's my index.html file opened in uh, gedit okay you can see that right here gedit and then to create your HTML file you just write some HTML tags um, HTML and a tag and then end HTML and then a body tag and an end body tag right and then I'll type in here this is my home page okay okay so if you can't see this maybe I can make the text a little bit bigger here Okay, so there is the, um, this is the basic structure of a um, web page. HTML tag, body tag, end body tag, HTML tag, your text goes between the body tags. Also, on a normal page, there would also be a head tag and an end head tag. And within there, you would have the title tag and the end title tag and right there you could put the head 
the title of your page, which will go in the top bar. Right. So anyway, that is the basic structure of a um, HTML web page. Um, you don't have to have this part if you don't want it. But anyway, I'll just hit save. Okay. And now, if I open up that browser window, and I just go to localhost, you'll see that the localhost page has changed from the Fedora default page to this is my site home page, and now you have a web page. Okay, so and that's all it took. Um, what was important was that I had the root privileges to be able to create the um, file in that folder. So index.html, I wouldn't have been able to create it if I did not have the root privileges. And um, so anyway, that hope that helps you out here. I'm going to close these windows here. And there's my terminal window which I needed to leave open if I was going to work with this and I'm also updating packages but hopefully that was um, clear so to change it what you had to do was go to system tools terminal sudo-l to get root privileges put in your password then open up Nautilus by typing in Nautilus and hit enter just from the command line when Nautilus opens up it doesn't have this cool browser window. It's actually kind of lame um, uh, if you open it up the other way. So what you really need to do is go to Edit Preferences and go to Behavior and click Always Open in Browser Windows. That'll make it look a lot nicer and make it look like this and that way you can navigate your folders visually much nicer. You go to Root. There we go. And your home page needs to go into your VAR folder www HTML directory and this is where you put your web pages okay I'll see you guys in the next video you would have the title tag